Hey guys, welcome to So This Happened, the news review that highlights the happenings that made the buzz recently. My name is Adebimpe Olajiga. Let's get into this. <laughs> it's high time we asked what actually goes on in the mind of some people. Ha, ah, guys, <laughs> imagine an housewife named Memuna Salaudin. She has been arrested for conspiring with others to kidnap her husband who she said has money but is very stingy. Men of the Ogun State Police Command accosted three young men, namely Olayin Kalawao, Asumba Nura, and Usman Oluatoin, whose look were highly suspicious on a motorcycle, and stopped them for search. While searching them, a cutlass and a rope were recovered from them. The team quickly separated them and questioned them individually about their mission in that area with a rope and a cutlass. Interestingly, the three of them gave different answers to the question. This further arose the suspicion of the policemen. In the course of interrogation, the three of them confessed that it was a woman that gave them the sum of 8,000 naira to buy a cutlass and a rope strong enough to tie a human being. They said she asked them to hide somewhere along E4 and that she would lure her husband to the place where they would kidnap him, tie him with the rope and also ask for ransom. They further informed the police that the woman said that is the only way that she can get money from her husband, who she accused of being very stingy. <laughs> the woman was brought to the scene and on seeing the arrested suspect, she admitted to being the brain behind the whole thing. She told the policeman that her husband has not been giving her money and that she decided to plan his kidnap in order to get money from him at all costs. <laughs> Orishi Rishi. Truly, an idle hand is the devil's workshop. Guys, on today's episode of My Country People, I present to you one Sunny Salah who shamelessly flashes his private part at women. Ha! I can't even imagine the scenario. <laughs> He was eventually arrested by the vigilante group in Kano State. Salisu Idris, the deputy vigilante commander in Medile area, said that the suspect has been on their wanted list after they received complaints from several women about his actions. Anytime he sees a group of women, he will just remove his trousers and before our men arrive the scene, he flees. <laughs> he noted that they finally caught him after he harassed a group of girls on Monday, November 1st, 2021. <laughs> but wait, are we going to call this a marketing strategy or madness? Ah, well, I know they finish show. <laughs> Now I'm done serving you with three fantastic stories that made a buzz during the week. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And most importantly, follow us on all our social media handles for via the second news update. Until next time, my name is Adebimpe Olajiga. Thank you for watching. <laughs>